<sighs> All right, so you're probably wondering why should I help sponsor Brandon? He looks like he's doing pretty well off. The principle is, yeah, I make decent money but I'm still struggling with bills. I'm not perfect, I'm not rich, definitely not that. And I have a lot of faith in God. And when this opportunity came to me, I said, God, I can't right now. Financially, like, I'm kind of tight. I'm backed up on certain things. And he said, no, trust me. I'm gonna have people support your vision. And you know what? That was kind of difficult for me because a lot of people don't help me out. I've had to do a lot of things on my own. I've, I've done many things on my own and definitely with the help of Christ and just believing in the power of God and the grace of God and he showed me something important one day I want to travel the world I want to reach out to people and spread the gospel but with love with service not just standing and, and talking to people but just reaching out giving them a hug showing them the love of God that is stored inside my heart and you know one of the most difficult things for me to do is to ask people for help and that was one of my biggest problems when I was depressed and when I was going through hell. I never cried for help until one night I was extremely wasted out of my mind and I was just drunk and I cried for help. And my friends were around me and they were worried about me. And God showed me that now even though I'm saved and my life is cleaned up, I still don't ask for help for certain things. And as a pastor, as a missionary, as an entrepreneur, as, as anything, you're gonna need help from other people. We were not placed on this earth to live alone. There's seven billion of us, and if seven billion of us worked together, how much better would this place be? And you know, I had to realize that unless I ask you guys for help, I'm not going on this trip. And the biggest thing about this trip is God's showing me to look outside the picture frame. The picture frame that we have is our families, the people we know and everybody. But outside that picture frame is people we've never met. And those are extremely important people, just as important as the family that's in the picture frame. And as I ask you guys for help, each and every one of you are planning towards a seed because this is gonna be a catalyst effect of my future. I'm gonna come back here on fire wanting to make a difference more than what I, what I can do now. Because I feel like a hypocrite. I've never lived in a third world country. I don't know exactly what it is, but I have the love of Jesus Christ inside of me and, and I just wanna reach out to that but I don't know where to start. I don't even know what really goes on over there. Yeah, I could read it, I could look it up on YouTube, but you don't know it. You don't know how to swim until you're thrown into the water and you actually start swimming. So I don't know what a third world country is like until I'm actually over there and breathing in that air and avoiding the water that they can't drink. <sighs> my earlier post was to face my giant and one of my giants is just letting people know I need help. And what I'm asking for help is if you guys fund me, it'll be a great help 